Awesome song. Um, how does it feel to be here in Miami for uh, UFC 299 Fight Week? Hey, uh, I feel very good. Nice weather. You know, I have a lot of friends coming from my country. I feel very good. Where do you feel like this ranks for you? Is this the biggest fight of your career, do you think? Yeah, definitely. This fight is uh, most most important in my life so far. Yeah, if I can win the fight, it will get me one step closer to the title. And Piotr Jan was a guy that I think there was some talk that you guys were maybe going to fight in December, and that didn't happen. But now you have him here. I guess was this a matchup that you really wanted? And and I guess kind of what do you think of him as an opponent? Yeah, definitely. This fight is. Really, I want it, and uh, we're supp supposed to fight him uh, last uh, December, but for some reason he p he pulled out, he got injury or something. But um, but not right now. It's it's a pretty good time, you know. I have uh, more time to prepare. Yeah, now I feel really good. Re I'm well prepared. I feel very good mentally, physically. Yeah. And um, what do you think of him as an opponent? I mean, he's, he was a champion, and then it seems like after he lost his title, he's kind of struggled to get wins. Um, so do you feel like he's still, like, right up there? He's, he's close to being the best in the world? Yeah, for sure. He's a, he's, he was a former champion and a top-level fighter, and uh, he had a great uh, striking. I believe he beat uh, Xiang, you know, so... He definitely is a great fighter still, yeah. And the long break won't affect him any, I think. Maybe give him more time to reflect on his skill and improve them. No. So, over here. Hi. Uh, do you think that Pyotr had beaten Aljamain Sterling in their second fight too? Because that was also very controversial and, you know, Pyotr thinks he won the rematch. Yeah, that was close fight, you know. I, either way. But I, I'm not a judge, but it's a close fight, yeah. Do you feel like sort of the forgotten man in this division because Sean's the champion, he's fighting Cheeto, a guy that you have a win over, and you're still main eventing these, these fight nights, and now you're on the pay-per-view under them. Do you sort of feel like the forgotten man in the division, and do you view this fight on Saturday as a way to kind of cement yourself in that group of contenders? Do <laughs> 啊，小乔，你会有没有注意到你？因为大家都是把目光注意在什么？呃，七头跟Sean，是，he's uh, a for, for, forgotten man, right? Yes, uh, actually, I don't care, you know. So Saturday night will prove that I'm the real star. Yeah. Can I get your thoughts on the main event between Cheeto and Sean? Uh, I like Sean, you know. I like his style. He's smart, and he definitely will win the fight. But I, I hope Cheeto win, you know. If he win, he may call me out, call me out because he always come late in our first match, you know. He, he saw he win the fight. But three judges decide I win the fight, you know. He always come in that. But I hope he win the he He do his best to win and uh, call me out. And I am nice the challenger, yeah. Last one for me. I saw on Monday you said that you felt you were the best boxer in the division. A lot of people also think Peter Jan is one of the best boxers in this division. So do you kind of view this fight as a way to cement who is actually the best boxer at 135 pounds? Yeah, I'm so confident of my boxing. I've I've been training a lot for such a long year, so I've, I'm so confident. But you will know, you guys will see Saturday night. Yeah, time will tell over here. I know you just said that a win here would get you closer to the title talks, but do you think the win would ultimately propel you right to the title shot, or do you see a world where you may have to win another one before you get the shot at Undisputed Gold? Uh, right now, it seems like Morab deserved title. I agree with that, but if I knock Peter out, maybe I'm next. Yeah. And also, I know you just mentioned how, Peter, how, how good Peter still is and everything, but do you think this is the best time to fight Peter Jan, given the recent run he's, he's been on and where everything hasn't really been going his way? Uh, sorry, can you repeat it? 
Yeah, so do you think this is like the best time to fight Peter Yan given the way things have been going in his career lately? Uh, I don't. I don't think so. He is a great fighter, uh, but you know he he is in uh, losing streak. I'm winning streak, but we will say 39. He maybe he spent one year to uh, ready for this fight. I don't know. 39, still 39. Rob right here. Um, you know, there's a lot of good bantamweight fights right now. Obviously, Marab just had his win. Sean's on this card. You're on this card. Umar just had a win. Is bantamweight the best division in the UFC right now? Yeah, I think it is. It's the best division. You know, he's a lot of good compact competitors over there. So, yeah, he's very good for me, for us. Yeah. And then just one more quick one. A lot of people have... You know, notice that this card is absolutely stacked. A lot of people were comparing it to UFC 300. Even were you surprised at how deep this particular pay-per-view is? Yeah, I'm very glad glad that I can be the main car. You know, so I'm excited for this car. This car is crazy. You know, yeah. I agree that it's this car to to ninety nine is um, like mm, in my opinion it's better than three hundred you know. All right, best of luck in the fight. Thank you. So I know you have a win over Cheeto uh, in the main event, but if you guys both go out there and win, do you think there's like that storyline over there that can be cooked up for a potential fight between you two again? Yeah, your last time you asked this question over uh, Apex, yeah, yeah. I remember you, so yes, I will, if uh, if Chido win, I would like to kick, kick his ass again, you know, yeah, I would like to fight him again, he always, he, he always uh, complain, he win the fight, I'm tired of that, you know, let's go, let's rematch, you yeah. uh, Song, over here, uh, when Jan fought Sean O'Malley, uh, Jan mixed in his wrestling, uh, is that something that you're expecting to see from him, or... Does this fight stay standing? Both okay. I like I like grab with him. I like strike with him. I'm uh, fully prepared. Yeah, all good. It doesn't matter for me. And uh, what are your thoughts on the all Chinese title fight between Zhang Weili and Yan Shanan? Uh, you know, they both, they both are my friends. I'm, I, I would be happy either both them win, you know. One more quick one right here. What are your thoughts on uh, Uriah Faber returning to action? Apparently he's going to be doing something for a, uh, for his promotion. Uh, you mean, uh, Uriah coming out of retirement or? What yeah, he apparently has a, a match schedule. That hasn't been said if it's a fight or maybe grappling, but... Really? I don't know that. Um, you know, he's been teaching right now. He has a lot of business to do, so... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Thank you so much.